What is up you guys? It's Greg here again and we are back with another Luxodor perfume and as you've seen in the title, this is Gypsy Blood from Luxodor. This is Luxodor's take on Perfumes de Marley Pegasus. So is it that close to Pegasus? Uh, pwede naman tayong gawing alternative ito to Pegasus, how close it is. Well, I don't really care kung malapis sila o hindi. I, I, I do care about how it smells, the quality of the perfume. That's what I care about more kesa sa kung gano'ng kalapit siya. Basta ako, kung mabango siya, yun. Again, thank you as always to Luxodor Philippines for making this video possible. If you haven't liked and followed their Facebook and Instagram store, the link is in the description. Make sure that you follow them to those social media accounts para updated kayo sa mga promos nila and availability. So, this is how the bottle looks like. So, it's a black and red. So, nung una kong siya nahawakan, sabi ko, uy, baka mamaya heavy, spicy, oud sense na naman ito. But, uh, yeah, hindi naman. Another ironic, alam mo yun, ah, uh, scent versus box parang ganyan and also yung yung name niya na Gypsy Blood parang na imagine ko dito is parang yung title lang isang movie na medyo horror movie alam mo yun now let's check the notes top notes are cumin bergamot middle notes are bitter almond lavender and jasmine base notes are vanilla heliotrope sandalwood and amber this is how the bottle looks like it's red and gold this is again a 30ml bottle and you can get this one at 750 pesos at their store. The bottle is heavy. Actually, it's eh. Pula. Sobrang astig na eh. Naastig na ako dito. Again, it's extremely perfumed. Spray natin siya. So, you can see. Yan. Sobrang, again, pare-pares naman siguro ang atomizer ng mga Luxodor. Sobrang kalat na kalat. The opening is a little bit medyo-medyo spicy. Konting-konting ko ba? Pinch of ano lang. Pinch of spiciness lang. Parang ganyan. Pero, immediately, you can smell almond in here. Yung almond na that we get from Pegasus, yung sweet, almondy, powdery. If I'm gonna go straight to what I think how it smells like, it's three things, alright? It's almondy, so parang medyo powdery siya. At the same time, medyo parang creamy. And it's also a bit sweet kasi because of the vanilla. So yun ang three dominant notes that you can smell on this perfume. But there's also this lavender na medyo parang nasa ilalim niya. Alam mo yun, na parang... Doon lang sa ilalim, I'm just gonna make you guys smell like not too linear, parang ganyan. And then there's the ambery, yung amber in the back makes it parang medyo yun nga, medyo some touch of masculinity, some touch of, of parang tapang naman, alam mo yun. Kasi palambot, okay, medyo soft yung approach nung pinagsamang almond and vanilla, okay, and also some heliotrope, right? So medyo malambot yung dating ng amoy niya. So yung scent niya doesn't smell like a masculine scent. Okay, uh, it's not a kind of scent na susuti ng isang bruce kong lalaki, ganyan. There's this striking uh, scent that I know I don't know kung saan nagagaling. Enough to make it like, you know, a masculine perfume, like pang lalaki siya. But it's not yung parang pang bruce ko nga, hindi siya yung pang talagang, alam mo yun, lalaking lalaking ganun. And also, nang-imagine ko na tao na gagamit nito is mayamang tao in his siguro 30s an introvert introvert na tao um, hindi masyado into gatherings hindi masyado into maramihang tao na lugar ganyan who prefers to be you know alone or with very close people very reserved kind of person parang ganyan tapos pag nakita mo siya marinis siyang tingnan kind of like how uh, a young governor looks like parang ganyan that has power that has money so that's what I imagine on the scent. So as you can see, not your typical fresh scent na pwedeng ano, araw-araw ganyan. Of course, this is a niche perfume so you won't expect na ito yung talagang parang it's not your Sauvage, it's not, it's not your Blue de Chanel. It's a very niche quality perfume. Again, it's almondy, clean, sweet, powdery scent. You know, yun ang, yun, yun ang pinakang puso, yun ang pinakang gitna ng scent na to. And my experience uh, of wearing this perfume is really impressive. For a 70 or for a 750 pesos perfume, this stays on my my, my clothes, on my aura sa paligid ko. Okay, uh, a scent bubble around me hanggang umuwi ako after office. So, and also since the nature of the perfume notes is talaga namang nag-stick on your skin, it, it clings on your skin longer than your usual typical fresh scents. So, understandable lang magsa-stay talaga siya. And uh, given yung fresh na parang powdery yung ganong profile ng scent niya, I don't think this is okay for hot weather. I think ito is pang indoor pa rin. Okay? So, if you're a professional, may position ka sa work, parang ganyan kasi nga, di ba? Parang expensive nga yung scent, yung scent niya. It's still for the indoors. So, if you guys wanna try niche perfumes without spending, kumagara talaga yung presyo ng mga niche perfumes, which is we all know medyo mahal talaga. For example, Pegasus, magkano isang bote, 10,000 pesos yata. So, not all of us kaya maglabas ng 10,000 agad for a perfume. So, Luxodor and their perfumes 
including gypsy blood is a great way or alternative so that you can try the scent first right before you actually give it a go so if you want to go to the pegasus the original one go for it gusto mo mag stay dito sa mga inspired ng luxador wala rin problema because the quality of luxador is very niche like very high quality and also performance wala namang problema so again guys the facebook and instagram of Luxador Philippines will be in the description box. If you want to purchase, just go to the link. So if you think this video helped and if you like it, make sure that you hit the like button below and comment your thoughts in the comment section. Also, kami mga request kayong perfumes, just let me know in the comment section. Thank you guys again for watching. Always keep safe and as always, see you in my next video. Peace.